as a symbol of continuing love for Dana, would you please place this ring on her finger? Brother Richard, would you repeat after me, please? Or, or, or you will respond by saying, I do. Brother Richard, do you promise to continue? You didn't want to repeat anything today, did you? Right? <laughs> Brother Richard, do you promise to continue to love, cherish, and to honor Dana through the remaining years of life together that God may grant you? I do. Sister Dana, as a symbol of your continuing love, Brother Richard, would you place this ring upon his finger? Sister Dana, do you promise to continue? You don't have to promise that. <laughs> Sister, Dana. Sister Dana, do you promise to continue to love, cherish, and to honor Richard through the remaining years of life together that God may grant to you? Do. You have vowed before God that you desire to continue this sanctity of marriage. Do you have anything that you would like to say to each other? Brother Richard, you... Have the honor to go first. Well, I can say that in looking to our past, little did I know when I looked across that bus one time in high school, did God have a big plan for our lives? That has been a long and wonderful journey of learning to know what love is when truly love only came when I came to know Christ. And then did I begin to learn how to love my wife. And I love you so much. And I'm so grateful for what God has done. And given me a great, wonderful lady of God as a wife. That has given me great, beautiful children. And also a uh, blessing. I had to write mine down. to celebrate 25 years of marriage, to reaffirm the commitment that we made to one another when we got married. As I think back through the years, I can remember many times of ups and many times of downs, many times of happiness, many times of heartache, times of plenty, and times of not. And our life hasn't been easy. But through it all, as I look back, I remember that you've been there, right by my side, as I stand here, I realize that our love for one another when we married was only a shallow imitation of the love that we have for each other today. God in his grace and mercy has taken two individuals and 